Hello everyone, today is November 30th, 2021. Let me explain to you one of our batteries in the factory. Its application is mainly on forklifts. The basic parameters of this product are using 16 series 5 parallel lithium iron phosphate battery pack. The voltage is 50 ohm.2 volts. Capacity is 500 amperes. Charging current is 0.5C, 250 amperes. Discharge current is 500 amperes. The size of this battery are Length 1220 millimeters. Width 350 millimeters. Height 750 millimeters. This battery has an ingenious design. It's divided into two parts, battery box and counterweight box. Why is there a counterweight part? Because the original forklift uses lead-acid batteries. Lead-acid batteries are very heavy. After changing to lithium battery, if there is no counterweight, the forklift's center of gravity will be unstable, easily rolled over when breaking. The battery is 228 kilograms. There are rings on both sides, can be taken out. Counterweight box is about 822 kilograms. The two parts can be separated. Take out the battery first when installing, then put the weight box in. Because the hole is more than one ton, if it is integrated, maintenance will not be convenient. Here are the details of this product's design. This is the bomb. We'll show the design drawing of the product's interior, such as product dimension drawing. This is equivalent to an effect picture. The upper part of the whole product is for batteries. The lower part is the iron block for counterweight, including some definitions of REMA connector. Flow chart of supply control for battery manufacturing. Now let's look at the specific details of our product. This port is a manual charging port. REMA interface with communication function. The other is an interface for automatic charging and discharging. The wire is thicker, can support a continuous current of 500 amperes. The communication port here. Need to use the communication line we configured through the host computer to view battery information include soc information here is the switch of the product battery indicator scan this qr code we can also use the mobile phone check some simple battery status you will see some basic battery parameters language can be switched with the mobile phone system that's all for today hope you guys like it we will show you inside of the battery in the next video